For Masterful, I'm Adam Falk. Roughly eight months ago, DARPA tested a specially designed aircraft called the Falcon Hypersonic Test Vehicle, or HTV-2. It went up, and within nine minutes, DARPA lost contact. So what happened? In a release on Monday, DARPA explained the HTV-2 was moving so fast, its skin peeled off, and the unmanned plane rolled and dove into the ocean, but not before restabilizing. DARPA explains. The initial shockwave disturbances experienced during the second flight exceeded by more than 100 times what the vehicle was designed to withstand. That's a major validation that we're advancing our understanding of aerodynamic control for hypersonic flight. The goal of the project is to create a plane that can travel anywhere in the world in just an hour. So scientists had to expect high speeds, right? Well, DARPA reports the plane was flying at Mach 20, or 20 times the speed of sound, for nearly three minutes, which CNN says is fast enough to get from New York to LA in 12 minutes. DARPA reports it couldn't have predicted this problem because ground testing can't mimic Mach 20 realities. No word on when DARPA will try for round three, but at least they'll return with a thicker skin. For Mashable, I'm Adam Falk.